guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm Kim K. Paul. Hope you guys had a really nice weekend. It's beautiful weather out, so I'm hoping it's like that all over the U.S. Um, probably in, maybe in about the 70s here, so that's really good. Um, I just wanted to hop on. I like I said before, I really hadn't been posting too many videos just because life was crazy and I just really honestly didn't get around to doing it with everything that was going on. So I did manage to accumulate a lot of things that I wanted to get on here and share with you guys. So today I just have my Target dollar spot haul. Um, I have fall and a little bit of Halloween decor from the Target dollar spot. I have so much Halloween and fall decor. Um, I just honestly, when I'm out now, I just try to really pick things that I know I'm definitely going to use. Um, cause if not, it's just, I have so much, so much accumulated. Um, so yeah, try to be pickier. Um, so yeah, I just have a couple things from Target, Dollar Spot, Fall and Halloween, and then a couple little things from The Giant for fall that I will show you. And after that, I will have um, some more videos coming out from Dollar General, some fall stuff that I found in there, and where else? Some more Dollar Tree stuff. So anyway, let's get started. So the first thing I found from the Target Dollar Spot for the Halloween was this sign, it just says Hocus Pocus. I love this, I think it's really, really cute. I love the black and white, it's just simple. Um, the little felt witch's hat. At first I thought this was wood too, but it's felt. So I thought that was really cute. And this is pretty thick too, so. And this was $3, so. I've noticed, when I go to get things at Target in the dollar spot, I mean, it's gone. Like, in the first, like, hour to a couple hours, they put it out. Like, it's unbelievable. And I don't know, I mean, I guess they get reshipments of things to restock, but it's incredible how fast these items go. So, like I said before, even with the Dollar Tree, if you see it while you're in there, don't think about it because when you come back to pick it up, it'll be gone, trust me. So this is the first item, very cute, like the Hocus Pocus. Um, next thing I got, this is probably more just home decor that you could use all the time. It's a set of two um, just called wood risers. They look like little wooden pallets, I guess you could say. And there's two in a pack. You can kind of see here's a smaller one and then they have the bigger one. And these look like they're made out of wood. And the two pack was, this was five, sorry, try to show you guys, five dollars. Um, and I just got the white. I thought this was really pretty. I thought it would match with my kitchen table. We don't have a dining room table, um, just, eaten in the kitchen all the time guys so the dining room actually became my son's kind of toy room which I'm sure that's probably happened to a lot of you guys comment down below if you're one of the people that your whole room has been taken over <laughs> so um this goes really well with the color of my kitchen table so I thought you know I could put this in the center you know put a little display so thought that was cute and then, let's see. Now this was actually in the clearance section there, but I wanted to show you guys because um, they usually put clearance on like the end caps and sometimes I always forget to look. So um, I found this, it's called Sea Glass, Notes of Sea Salt and Fresh Aloe, Soy Blend Cloche Candle. Now, it says it was originally $14.99 and it was reduced down to $7.49. Um, this is what it looks like. So that's really cute. I like that a lot. Actually, let me, let me open this and I can kind of tell you guys what I think of the scent. Let's see. Oh, that's nice. Oh, that's really nice. 
it doesn't tell you kind of like, you know, the scent, I guess. Well, it does say notes of sea salt and fresh aloe, but, oh, that is nice, guys. And I just thought that was so pretty. I, and I love like the cloche part. I mean, I've always kind of been looking for a cloche, but I didn't want to spend like an enormous amount of money. So I was like, well, for $7.49, you get the cloche and you get a probably good smelling candle. So I just figured, you know, why not? So I got that. So check out your Target clearance. You never know what they're gonna be putting in there. Um, the next thing I got, and let me take these out of the bag just so you can see them better. I'm not really sure why they had these in bags, to be honest. But I don't know. At my store, they kept everything in these kind of bags. So, all right. So the first one I have, and they look like they look like little witches' cauldrons. And this is called Hocus Pocus Pumpkin. Oh, and it smells amazing. Love the pumpkin scent. And this was $3. And then I got another one. This is Spellbound Sangria. Oh, this smells nice too. So that's what that looks like. Cute cauldron. And I mean, you can reuse the cauldron afterwards. You could even put this like on your kitchen sink to put like a sponge in or to put your rings or whatever when you're washing dishes so that was a cute find i like that and then i wanted to get these last year and i i missed out um and then as soon as i saw them this year i grabbed them but they're these pretty what are they calling these taper candlestick holder and this is just really really pretty i really like this a lot and these were three dollars so I did get two. I only saw the gold color. I don't know if they had other colors, but I only saw the gold. But I thought they were really, really pretty. And then they also had like a round version. Um, and you could put like four taper candles in there. Um, but I liked just the two simple ones. Um, and then with that, I did get the taper candles. Um, they were $3. They're just a 10 inch tapers um honestly i probably just could have went to the dollar store and got um like the battery operated ones or the wax ones but i've never seen like color ones at the dollar tree i've only just seen like the basic you know cream or white wax so i really liked the orange color so i picked those up to go with the candle holders so i thought those were really pretty uh, let's see. Next, let me just pull all these out here at once. And it's like, guys, I don't know about you, but I have probably a small obsession with uh, pumpkins. <laughs> um, I love all the ones that the Dollar Tree always puts out. I think they're adorable. And then I saw these at Target and I just fell in love. I mean, the colors are gorgeous. I love, well here, let me just show you, see what I'm talking about. So this is the first one I got. It's like a teal color. It's beautiful. It almost looks like it's carved from wood. Isn't that just so beautiful? I love this. This was $3. And I, I love this color. It's just, I don't even know what they're calling this color. I'm just calling it teal. It doesn't have a name, but I, it's beautiful. I love this so much. And then with that, I got one in this color. Same, same kind of shade, maybe a little different. Um, got this in just the classic orange. Thought that was pretty. Then I found this one. Oh, I thought this was beautiful too. Now it's a different shape, you can see. This one was still $3. And the color's beautiful, I love it. It's like a, almost like a maroon color, I guess you could say. But I just thought it was so pretty. I mean, these like, you know, on your table, your side table, I mean, mantle, it's beautiful. And, you know, the price isn't really too bad. I mean, 
three dollars you know I know the Dollar Tree was selling those really like nice heavy cement ones for like what was it maybe I don't know a couple years ago they had them and they were only a dollar but I mean I couldn't pass these up they're so pretty I like these all right next on the same token is the pumpkins um oh I got one more of the wooden type pumpkin so it's even a little bit different shape this one's a little bit wider this one's a little bit i guess narrow but it's really really pretty and i love this mustard yellow color i love this and again three dollars and then i did pick up this white pumpkin i thought this was really pretty this again three dollars and I have <laughs> so many pumpkins, guys. It's not even funny. But I thought this was just really, really just classic, simple. And I may even, like I was telling you guys, just like set it on like, you know, my little tray here. And just put some flowers in maybe even like this pumpkin here. Like do a little display or something. I don't know. But it's, it's going to look really pretty, I think. So I'm really excited to get started with that. And let's see. The next, oh, the last little pumpkin that I got. I only snagged one of the little ones. Um, this is a dollar. It says it doesn't have like the traditional tag, but it, you can see hopefully there it says a dollar. Um, but I just got this one. I thought it was really pretty. I thought it would pair well with this one. Um, they had a bunch of other ones that match the other types, but I didn't really want to pick any more up because I picked up a lot. And then next in the dollar spot section, I picked up this mug. It's just ceramic coffee cup. This was $5. And I thought this was really, really cute. I like this. I'm like a sucker for a good animal print. <laughs> When I was younger, like when me and my husband like got our first place, it was an apartment and I was just constantly buying like zebra print everything. Like my husband was like, what are you doing? Like, it looks like a zoo in here. Like between the leopard print, the zebra print, like what are you doing? So as I got older, my taste has changed, but I still do like the animal print on some things. I still think it's cute. So anyway, I got that and it has like a really cute lid and I need me some coffee in the morning, which I'm sure all you out there can relate. So I picked up that and then I did get this for my little boy for Halloween. Um, and again, this comes with paint. I don't know about the paint guys with my little boy. I'm going to see if we can use marker with it just to see, but it's a little, um, it says pyro ceramic figure, but it looks like this. I think it's, I thought at first it was supposed to be like Frankenstein and he loves Frankenstein, but I think it's just supposed to be a zombie because you can see his brains up here. So I'm thinking that's what it's supposed to be. And this is $3. So I got that. I thought that was cute. And then let's see, I do have a couple other things that I want to show. Um, I found these gorgeous picture frames. How cute are these? I don't know what the size of the frame is. It does not say anywhere. But I'm guessing it's maybe like a four by six, like this part in here. And down below it says family. I just thought that was so pretty. And this was $3, if you can see on the back. And then I did get one in the black and this just says thankful. But I just thought they were so pretty. I love these. I got two of those. And let me grab my other bag over here. Give me one second. All right. 
Sorry about that, guys. Next thing I found were these lanterns. And I was on the hunt for these because I thought these were so pretty. I love these. What is this called? Just Light Up Barn House. And they were $5. Okay. And they have a little handle. And I did find the two different sizes. So this one's a little taller. This is a little shorter. Um, and they do have the fairy lights inside. Now, I don't have the batteries in here, but I'm sure at night this is going to look really, really pretty. And I was thinking you could even, like, put some of those little, like, sunflower clip flowers on there. Like, I think that would look really nice. So, I was excited about that. Get and last from the Target dollar spot, I was able to find, and I'm so glad I did because I really, really was on the hunt for these, um, are like the scary Halloween-ish candles. So they do require batteries, which I didn't put in yet, but... Um, I'm sure it's gonna look cute, just like your regular standard battery operated candle. Um, and it looks like it's got the melted wax for Halloween. You can see that kind of up close, it's cute. So I got, I got three of just the regular cream white color. And then I was only able to find one in the black. And they do take two triple, no, two double A batteries. Two double A batteries. And I was really disappointed in all of my targets that I went to. I tried two to find these. The only ones that were left were missing, like, oh, no, those two did. They were missing, like, the battery, like, you know, where you put the compartment back on. Like, I don't know. Like, that was kind of weird. So, I don't know, but hopefully the batteries will stay in without those, but, you know, who knows. But anyway, so that was everything that I got from the Target dollar spot and the one clearance thing from Target. So, I just have two things I want to show you really quick from the Giant um, grocery store. Um, I found these two little pumpkins. It says, Happy Harvest. Isn't that adorable? I love this. I love just the simple rusticy look and it's really really cute. And these were $2.99 so I didn't think that was too bad. I mean they have the raffia bow, the little sign here. I mean I thought it was worth the three dollars that I paid. So I got that one and then they also had this one which says give and thanks. So that's that one. And they do kind of have like the similar big pumpkin, but then they have the different little color pumpkins. So I had to get both. So I thought they were cute. So that is everything from Target and the Giant. So like I said, check your Giant grocery stores or any grocery store that you shop in really. I mean, I've been to Weiss and they have really cute things too for both Halloween and fall. Um, I may see if they have anything worth grabbing though. Um, if so, I'll show you guys. Um, and like I said, I do have a Dollar General haul and a another Dollar Tree fall haul coming. Um, I was finally able to find like the whole collection of the pumpkin plates. I was so excited to find those. Um, I was not able to find the glasses that I wanted to, that match the plates and like the little plates and you know the dish towels and all that but um, I was able to find another glass um, that said grateful so I will come back on and I will show you guys all of that so anyway thanks for tuning in guys I really appreciate you watching the videos and if you do like my videos please like and subscribe that would really help me out 
So anyway, have a great rest of your weekend and I will catch you in the next video. Bye guys.